632. Today, senators are set to vote on whether to hear from more witnesses and see new evidence in the impeachment trial. Earlier this week, Majority Leader Mitch McConnell said he didn't have the votes to block new testimony, but things are changing now in Washington. Mandy Knoll joins us now with why Democrats actually might not have those numbers they thought they did after all. Hey, Mandy. Senators wrapped up their Q&A session yesterday with many asking why we even needed to hear from any more witnesses anyway. The president's defense team accused Democrats of wanting the trial to draw on through the entire election year. Democrats say they could limit testimony to just one week. The House managers also offered to do witness depositions while the Senate goes back to business as usual. But most Republicans have already made up their minds. Democrats need four Republicans to side with them. Senator Susan Collins is on board, while Mitt Romney and Lisa Murkowski both say they're interested. The fourth senator, though, that was kind of on the fence now says he won't vote for witnesses. That's Tennessee's Lamar Alexander, now saying President Trump's Ukraine controversy was inappropriate, but not enough to have him removed from office. Senator Alexander's vote guarantees at least a 50-50 tie. Democrats can't convince someone to break the tie. Senate Republicans would likely move forward toward acquittal. That could happen sometime tonight. Back to you guys.